I'm at the 99, the 100 yen store. And I just saw something that is so kawaii that I can't even stand it. This is like 90 cents. Rice bowl. Look at the little J post. The police. Oh my god. Is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen in your entire life? Japan has a bunch of uh, 100 yen stores, 99 cent stores, because you know it's Japan, it's the yen. Royale with cheese, as it were. And right now it's camping season, so there's a lot of kawaii camping action. Japanese camping is not like it's American cousin. It's a lot of, just look at how cute everything is. I mean, there's no like, uh, I mean, there's a fire and all, but a lot of Japanese is more like yakitori stuff, like little things on the grill. But hey, still don't like this. These are skewers for yakitori. I mean, everything in Japan has got to be extra cute. It's like, okay, we're gonna make. Oh, they're potato chip eating clips. Full hands, just here. I mean, Japan's like a. Uh, it's like that scene at Indiana Jones where they, they crane out and the Ark is in the warehouse. Japan's like that warehouse, but it's just all the cute. It's so full of the cute. And of course, your fun English. All of them wear simple life and holiday apron. Oh, a set of wooden utensils for camping for 90 cents because, you know, and they're they're just beautiful. Oh, and how about a water bottle, netted water bottle holder, a paracord, a paracord bottle holder for 86 cents or so, let's say. I mean, I could, I could spend all the money anyone could ever give me, 100 yen at a time in Japan, because we're in one corner of like... You know, we're just over here. We're just in the random section. I mean, what what did I just see? That was just like triple color. Oh, some little boxes. Oh my goodness, look at this. A little toolbox with a little red one latch on it. Oh my goodness. Hello, friend. Take me home, Martin. You'll find something to put in me. Oh, come on, you shouldn't be going with me. I'm made out of plastic. Come on, I'm 100 yen. You got the money. I don't want to buy you. I got it. But how about me? I'm Midori. You're going to like me. For real. I'm flat. Come on. You've got something that fits in a box like this. I'm 100 yen. Take me home. I don't want to take you home, though. Come on. Take me home like a Phil Collins song. You know, take... Don't sing to me, box. The clear ones? Oh, this little itsy-bitsy one over here? Oh, my God. Or how about a little teeny tiny can of ginger ale. Japan has teeny sodas. This is 58. 58 calorie ginger ale. Oh, oh, hey Martin, I'm over here, over here. A compass? Oh my goodness. With all kanji? That's the sound of me taking this home with me. I got it, I, I, and here's the sad part. I have one of these, but I need another. I can't find the one I have. 100 yen down. I'm gonna go now. Oh, you wanna see more? Okay. Oh, how about umbrellas? This, this umbrella, this model umbrella is like ubiquitous here. This particular clear umbrella model. Huh? Kids' raincoats. Oh, but let's just make them extra, extra cute. Okay, sure. How about a red one? Extra cute. How about we'll color coat them for size? And then we'll throw on one for Martin to be confused by. It's just an endless stream of, of kawaii. Kawaii is, it means cute. Speaking of kawaii, Dixie cups. But a little bit smaller than a Dixie cup. And a little cute mini. I mean, 
It's just cow a -Man. How about a leisure sheet? Anyone need a leisure sheet? Oh, this is a, oh, Japanese love to have a picnic uh, blanket. This is a small size picnic blanket. So when you want to sit out, you don't have to sit on the floor. Oh, 110 yen. Now, well, this is going to be 50 bucks in America. This is a, a bowl you use to grab. You put like sesame seeds in it. Uh, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's got a Japanese word, of course. But 110 yen. Oh, this one's, this one's beautiful. Look at that. I mean, that looks like an object of art for 90 cents. Oh, the kawaii alert's going on in the camping section again. Kawaii, kawaii. This is canned gas. Speaking of Japanese camping, you need canned gas. These are little cans of gas that fit in little burners, which are probably above the 100 yen point. And then you can cook yourself. Oh my God, another kawaii is going off. A little sandwich press. All right, come on. Let's leave this corner. Let's go this way. What is this? What is this? Great mystery. Something turns into something. Oh, a microwave, micro, microwave dish. What's this? Oh, it's like a pickle cup. Eat a lot of pickles here. They don't eat a lot of pickles here, but they have pickle condiment for curry. I'm wearing the stupid hat, but that's okay. Stupid guy, stupid hat. What are you doing today? I got it through with a scout, and now I'm just walking around a 100 yen store looking at stuff. Another thing that gets me is the uh, Ziploc bags. Sometimes they will... <laughs> Look what they represent. The representative. Put your A5 Kobe beef in this Ziploc bag. It's just like... This is a... Uh, I know what this is because I've had to ask. This is pan, paper you put in your pan so your pan doesn't get dirty. You know, when you're cooking your stuff. Mochi. How about I'll turn it the right way? Mochi, hamburg, pizza. Oh, fancy poly bag. Oh my god. Some fun English. Keep them fresh. Long term storage. I mean, it's just. Kawaii, 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 kawaii. I mean store your stuff here and then behind me there's just like a a world of design the whole world is full of design just cute 100 yen design stain oh, look at this little guy hey fella you're made in japan well that's no surprise to me just a little measuring cup isn't that cute stainless mini measuring cup I could spend a thousand dollars, a hundred yen at a time. Not a cleaning fan, but they just have the cutest cleaning stuff. A little notch on the side. Come on, come on. Oh, wait for it. What is this? Remove dirt and grime. It's in the shape of a cat. Nekachan. Look at that. This one's a black and white cat. I mean, and this is a old gaijin hit, meaning that like, if you come here, you'll be like, what? The first time? That's uh, a toilet sheet cover. So my cat's name is Panda. Panda. So you can put these sheets on your toilet to cover them. It seems less than sanitary to me, but you know, I'm going to Oh, I need one of these. Sponge. I end up getting one of these because I love these to clean myself with. And then I end up not getting them for my wife or my son. And then everyone gets mad at me. Am I going to repeat my mistake? Ooh, look, men's body towel. No, my skin's too delicate for man's body towel. Oh my God. Design alert. Shower cap. Oh, you get a three pack, but these are, oh, that's not even a three pack. That's a, that way. Hmm. 
I love wearing these headbands, but they make me look so, not what I'm going for, but they're cozy. If you have a lot of hair, a real mountain of hair, this feels good, but it, it looks bad. I'm not her. I'm this guy, and I don't have, it doesn't work with me. It just looks like, I don't know, just otherworldly. Not otherworldly, yeah, otherworldly. Uh-oh, Kawaii alert. Okay, a brand explosion. Kellogg's, Frosted Flakes, Tony the Tiger, Lady Size Socks. And of course, they're great in this variety. <laughs> if I were a Japanese woman, I would be the kawaii -est. Oh my God, look at this. Look at the options. Popcorn socks. If they made these popcorn socks in my size, they'd be coming with me. I mean, popcorn socks. Ankle popcorn socks. Oh, what is this? Dog socks. <gasps> Printed dog socks. Why am I talking in this voice? Printed dog socks. For women, Martin. See, we printed it here, because you're not going to take home these dog socks, fella. You got it? More, 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 you say? Okay, okay. Hold on. No ketai. I don't know what that means. I can't read Japanese. Sorry. What is this? Oh, it's, I think it's a accoutrement for kids' lunches. This is a sando sandwich, a cake, uh, what do you call it? Fruit sandwich. Picture on the patch. Oh my god. <gasps> Peanuts. Peanuts cloth pouch. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's the sound of me taking that home with me. See, I'm 300 yen deep already. Desire. Desire is the root of all suffering. Doesn't feel like suffering right now. Feels like a, a little endorphin release. Oh, this is something I need. Oh. Perfect. The wood. Oh, 400 yen? Well, that's way above my pay grade. I need a doubler. It's a USB. This is a, it's a USB wooden thingy. I don't know what you call it. I need a thing that just doubles the outlets. I want that because it's adorable. But I don't really need that. Oh, and here in Japan? You know who's alive and well? The cassette tape, 90s and 60s, and the CDR, it's doing well. She probably doesn't have mini disc here. Oh, DVDR, a bunch of brands of CDR, Blu ray disc R. Gosh, so much good stuff. Dust cover for film for AirPods. Headphone holder hook. What is this? AirPod, AirPod fall prevention strap. It's a deep well. And then you can find something real practical. Well, this is a 330 yen item, surprise. USB-C, the headphone port. Well, that's a handy one. I mean, a lot of things in Japan are stupidly expensive. Like, up in the Anaka, in the countryside where I live, like, that's gonna be $14. But there's some kind of, like, exclusionary zone or something, because things at the 100 yen store are really cheap, because it's the 100 yen store. But there's, like, some loophole, because a lot of things in Japan are, like, the prices, I don't know, of Japanese economics, but they, they feel like they're sort of adjusted to make things affordable, uh, like a living wage, like an apple. An apple off-season can cost you three dollars here um, because they want you to either. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna get into ac Japanese economics. Let's get back to Kawaiinas. Sorry. Sorry, you stop. The thing at this point, my wife doesn't even question these things when I'm buying them. She's just like, "Yep, he bought a, a Woodstock yellow pouch." I mean, it's my hundred yen. Oh. Oh, this is another good one. 
glue. This is kids glue. Japan. All sorts of glue. Uh, before I let you go, we're gonna go to the snack section in the 100 yen store and maybe I'll find something for my son. As a professional dad, I keep snacks on hand at all times, tucked away and hidden like a little squirrel. Yeah, miracle body. Oh. Juicy. What type of little snack is guys you're not know, supposed to have? Oh, I know what he's gonna have. These gummies. Japan is a strong gummy game. I have not seen these before. I'm gonna get these gummies for him. He may not like them, but they'll be different. Let's see my Andrew up in the Kit Kat season. Halloween break? I'll leave it there. Oh my God, what's this? I'm gonna get him this, whatever this is. I think it's melon soda's flavor or something. I'm gonna get him that one. I should I get him the cherry gummies? And there's his jam, we get the cherry gummies, melon soda. Those wasabi flavored chips? Anyway, I gotta go. Until next time, I'll be here in Japan.